Good evening and welcome to The Classical Now. I'm Will Fraser and tonight I'm joined by the guitarist Daniel Bolshoi. Daniel, it's lovely to have you on the show tonight. Thank you, Will. It's nice to be here. Uh, Daniel, um, most people are probably more familiar with the guitar um, as an instrument in a popular idiom rather than a classical idiom. Could you tell us uh, what the difference is between classical and, and popular guitar? The wonderful thing about the guitar, especially the classical guitar, is that it, it can be used for all these types of music. And I always look for music that, that appeals to me because it crosses over that, that gap between popular culture and, and the classical tradition. Uh, and I have examples of, of music like that from as, as early on as the 16th century. So the guitar has always been associated with, if you like, street culture or popular culture? Absolutely. Um, I'll give you an example. Um, the first ancestors that we look, look to are the viola players from 16th century Spain. These were instruments that um, were regarded as, as, as highly as the lute everywhere else in Europe. The lute uh, did, not, did, not make a, did not win a place for itself in Spain. The viola is a six course instrument. A course basically means two, two uh, strings, double strings, just like a 12 string guitar really. Um, and these, these court musicians led music life in, in the court, but they were always interested in what their counterparts uh, strumming away at the four chorus guitar uh, were doing. Uh, Luis de Narvaez actually set a, a series of variations on a folk song that was very popular uh, during the 16th century called Watch Over the Cows For Me, uh, Gardamelas Bacas. And that's one of the pieces you're playing. Indeed. Um, at, I still want to know what, what it is that that person is doing while he's asking somebody to watch over the cows for him. But uh, it's, a, it's a great example of, of using a very classical 16th century technique, the differencias or the variations. Uh, in, in England, that was called the divisions. Uh, and in Spain, the differencias or the little differences or variations. So that's a very classical idea, um, ornamenting, scales, all kinds of techniques are particular to that instrument, but the, the underlying bass line is entirely derived from a popular song. 